Hey, what's up? Thank you so much for joining to another video. Today I would like to show you how I add colors to my type. I found this secret weapon inside Adobe Illustrator that I think every designer should know. It's super easy to use and it makes your design process so much faster when it comes to add colors to your type. So if you're ready, let's do it. Okay guys, so we are now in uh, Adobe Illustrator and I would like to show you the colors that I've been using on Lingerie White Pro. Lingerie White Pro is the new typeface that I designed. It's super playful. You can see the colors. I mean, I did so many colors variations and you can find inside the type so many ligatures and swatches and ready-made words and you can do so much with it and you can see how i played with the colors now i invested some times with the design here of course but when it comes to add colors to the type it was basically pretty simple and fast and the way that I did it, I'm gonna show you right now. So let's take this sample here and I'm gonna work on a separate outboard. So I took the same sample here, as you can see, and now we're gonna go to the black and white sample and we're just gonna colorize it. Now I'm sure that there are many, many ways to do it, but I will show you my way to do it in the fastest way and probably the coolest way in Illustrator. It's a hidden key and hidden tool. I don't know, some of you probably saw me doing it in the previous tutorials that I published. Some of you probably know the tool. Um, and the tool called Live Paint Bucket. The shortcut is K, so if you hit the K button, you will see the shortcut. And the way that you're doing it is very simple. First of all, I prepare the color palette on my swatches, so you see that it goes by the same order as this color palette. Okay, so the first color palette is on the top row and the second palette is on the bottom row so the way that you're doing it is very simple first of all you need to take the type you can also apply to any kind of illustrations or like any kind of graphic elements but you know i'm color i'm just adding colors to my type so the way that you're doing it is very simple you need to create outline of the type and select it. Once you select it, click K or go to the live paint bucket. Now select the color that you want to use and just click where you want to color. So I'm gonna click and then I'm gonna go again to the window, the swatches window, select another color, click and click. And I can make the window even closer that I won't go too far, you know, with my uh, with my cursor here. But there is a better way to do it. If you click on the right arrow on your keyboard, you're just scrolling between the colors. So if I scroll again, right, I go to the yellow color, right, I'll go to the next color another right and so on so it's very simple as you can see all you need is select the color click on the mouse and you color the type now let's go to the second row and I'm gonna colorize all this with blue right arrow right arrow right arrow you see it's that simple 
that's it. So basically, this is how you're doing it. Now, I'm going to color all the rest of the type here, the rest of the ligature. And I'm going to do it in a fast forward so you won't get bored too much. But you will see how easy it is to do it. Okay, so see you in a second. This is how I'm adding colors to my type. You see, it's super simple and super fast. I hope that you will use this tool because I believe it will, can save you a lot of time. If you like this video, please make sure to like and subscribe and turn on the notification button. Until the next video, take care and see you soon.